माननीय सभा सदस्यों माननीय उप सभापति जी स्टेचुटरी रिजोल्यूशन द होम्योपैथ सेंट्रल काउंसिल अमेंडमेंट बिल 2019 टू बी डिस्कस टुगेदर देयर आर थ्री मूवर्स श्री डी राजा श्री विनय विश्वम श्री अलारम करीम श्री विनय विश्वम विल मूव द बिल डी राजा साहब ऑनरेबल डी राजा साहब मेट मी एंड ही टोल्ड दैट श्री विनय विश्वम विल मूव सर often the government forgets that this is the parliamentary democracy first please read the resolution read the resolution vishwam ji sir i move the resolution now can you speak sir please please speak for few minutes often this government forgets that this is a parliamentary democracy they believe that this is a presidential form of governments they forget the parliaments they deny its importance they neglect that the parliament is the people's representative body that's why always they take a route of ordinance so in the government system sometimes a need may arise to issue some ordinances okay. one can understand it but one after another every day and night a government always thinking about ordinance ordinance and ordinance means that government has least consideration about the democratic norms so this is a practice that should be questioned so i request you as an honorable leader of the house and the deputy chairman a man with great knowledge time nahi aa raha whose record is very straight and great i request you to come for the rescue of the parliamentary democracy to uphold the values of parliamentary democracy to advise the government not to behave like this in the future sir why should the government why should be the government so afraid of the parliament many a cases we can see often there is no urgency sometimes when there is urgency like elections one can even argue maybe because of political compulsions they are doing it even such occasions when there can be no such combustions are there they are coming with ordinances this ordinance on homeopathy is like that sir this bill could have been very easily discussed and consulted and even even passed in the parliament but the government which has the habit of ordinance decided that let us have one more ordinance in this regards so this board of governors of which the bill now speaks that board of governors is going to bypass the central homeopathy council so that council is having some authorities now government found out that that council was full of corruption corruption sir exists not only in that council corruption is in the body politics of this country from the top most to the lower level of the government that the rule of the day the every uh, let him speak please don't don't interrupt please speak he was telling a truth, please sir. please speak there is a gene of corruption in the government i don't want to narrate all those things due to lack of time but nobody can single out the instance where there is no corruption now now suddenly the government felt that in central homeopathic council there is corruption so that has to be do away with done away with so they thought to have an ordinance in that ordinance they came with a proposal to have a board of governors and now the bill wanted to extend its tenure also from one year to two year the bill says that the government has the power to do anything they can choose the people they can set the people they can extend everything like a brahma srishti sthiti samhar all are with the government sir in a democracy 
no government is the brahma in a democracy we the people are the brahma we made the government we made the parliament we made the laws but the government thinks that we the people are non entity that's the psych behind this ordinance roots this can't be allowed sir sir who will choose the members of the governing body the governments what's the yastik they approve for that nobody knows sir what about the content of that body not very clear sir the home of us in this country thousands and lakhs of them are there most affection most of them are and those people are to be adequately represented in this body adequate representation means not at the will and pressure of the governments people should feel that this body of governors is a real body who can govern the matters that means there should be people with integrity then only they can fight corruption so i repeat home you pass from both the government and private sector who has a great experience in this branch of medicine with the great medicine branch branch they should be properly and adequately representative in this in this, in this uh, board of governors please this please my please sir i am sure that you will take care of it thank you thank you the resolution moved